hello what's up guys um this is akopero welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel kindly subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so that you will be notified whenever i post a new video yeah so uh welcome back once again so i just want to show you guys on how you can be able to train the market like bastard understand the market behavior if you have been following me since last week you will know you will know that i've been uh um making videos on this v 75 on how you can on uh, how you can buy and sell on this um v 75 you understand so yeah so without wasting much of your time let me just uh give you guys a little example on how you can be able to trade this market this static index like uh, as you all know it doesn't move with uh, news or any uh it doesn't move with news or any uh economic crisis all those stuff so it's it's we traders that move the market you understand so now let me tell you guys this thing um for you to be consistently profit in market in this forex uh, trading you have to be like you have to know price action guys i know you may be uh, if you are new to trading you will, you will depend on indicators going to one minute time frame to be um to scalping the market you want to make millions in a day other stuff but to be honest with you guys if you want to make that millions it's you have to know price action price action is the key guys is the key and because of that you guys have been um your knowledge of knowing price action have been paralyzed guys it have been paralyzed because you, you always depend on indicators moving average other stuff all those stuff are they are just there for confirmation like i always say they are just there for confirmation guys so yeah without wasting much of time let's say this market is up here want to go down now you break your trend line you got your trend line broken and be retested you understand let's say the market is still here okay let me just draw that level and show you guys what it uh it, it did on four hour time frame this level right here you can see this retest this green candle with this uh three uh, uh long brick at the top there now that's how you will know that this market is retesting because this bearish candle have already broken the trend line. You understand? Now let's go to four hour time frame to see the uh, to see what the market did there. Now here we go. As you can see, now this is that uh, red bullish uh, bearish candle that broke that trend line. Now this is the retest, guys. You enter your market after seeing this retest understand you enter your ma the market after seeing this retest if you enter your market the, the, uh, your order here you open your order here you put your stop loss above now you'll be making all this all this you'll be making all this down to here you understand so this is quite simple very very simple for you guys to understand now this is for selling opportunity now let's go to weekly time frame again for for a buying opportunity you understand now let's see that let's see that this market have um, created a double bottom here as we all know double bottom is uh, a buying signal yeah, a buying signal yeah so this market have created a double bottom here with this uh, bullish candle right here so all you need to do is just bring out your trend line go guys all these things they are there in your mt5 trend line uh rectangular line all these uh things like for price action they are there in your mt5 it's for you to neutralize them in your chart that's the biggest problem you guys are having you understand now this is the breakout this is the breakout right here you can see after this breakout there's a rejection you can see this rejection right here this rejection now let's go to four hour time frame to see what what's hap what happened to that rejection there yeah 
This is it. This is it right here. This is that rejection right here. Now let's go to our, our weekly time frame to confirm. You see, that's that rejection. That's that rejection candlestick. You can see it there. So you can see that in four hour time frame, it broke. It broke that trend line. It broke that this trend line and retested and leave this pin bar, this candlestick right here. You understand? So after that, you can buy from there. Put your stop loss below. Then you can be making all this, guys. You can be making all this. You understand? Each candlestick for our for our time. Like four hour time frame. This is four hour time frame. Each candlestick there is four hour. Each candlestick four hour. You know how much you'll be making in two hours or even in three hours or even in four hours. You understand? So this is very very simple guys. This is very very simple. I don't want this to be complicated to you guys. This is how you identify when the market is trending and when it's about to reverse. Use your trend line. Identify the candlestick patterns. This will help you to win. You only use this all this moving average just for confirmation, guys. So let me just go to um why I took this trade. Like I said, I've been making a video based on this chart. Because I want you guys to know what you need to look for when you are focusing too much on indicators that will make your um, ability and um, your the knowledge you have in price action to fade away you understand then you end up saying that you don't know what is wrong with you like something uh, this trading of a team is not working out for you is because you, your, your mindset towards it is not the way you're supposed to think the way you think about trading is the, it's not the way you're supposed to think you understand so just want to close this trend but i said let me just make this video for you guys to have this uh for you guys to be motivated that this trading of a team is possible for everyone for everyone who care to know you understand now this is the first touch here this is the second touch this is the third touch as we all know when the market have touched for the third time either it break down below or it continue going to the uh to the opposite side you understand so like i said you can see this moving average they are there for confirmation they are just supporting 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 you understand so i think i support here so now this is the first touch this is the second touch the third touch will definitely break because the third touch over here didn't break below you understand so we call this we call this wages we call this uh pattern wait it's not like like now you can see the market going down it's not like the the charts have changed and some can call it flag also it's not like the the, the um market is going to sell but you just and then it's just doing a, um you can call it correction to gain a lot of momentum to buy you understand so you can see that breakout the time this market broke out broke out from here i bought it I bought it all the way to here. Then I said it on the video again that this market is going to sell again. If you can watch, if you can watch my previous video, I saw I told you guys that this market is going to sell. Then I sold it again. I said that this market is going to reach at this level. After reaching this level, it will buy. Then this is what happened. After that, I bought again. You understand? Now, how do you, how do I know? How do I know that this market is going to sell from here? What give me that reason, like that confidence for me to identify this zone as a, a selling zone? Now this is it. What I did, I um bring out my horizontal line this way, place it here. You understand? Then I went back to the to the previous uh to my previous chart to see what uh, the market did there before you understand so now this is it you can see that this market 
supported uh, resisted here this is a significant high since this volatility index have been um, added to this synthetic index this is the highest high so far you can see this is last year 2021 i think august or or july something like that you understand so you can see that this is the highest high so this market can just can just go to this level and break it no it doesn't it, it, it is not programmed like that because this this chart is being programmed by reward market you understand so it's we traders that move the market so it can't just break break above and start buying no it have to come back to retest to gain a lot of bias you understand let me just show you guys it have to come back to retest to this zone to gain a lot of strength from buyers like a lot of others for it for for we to push the market upwards you understand so now let me show you guys why i bought from here i bought from here to this level and, and sold from here to this here let's go to our 30 minutes time frame now this is our 30 minutes time frame what happened the market broke the market broke and retested was the market broke again the market broke again and retested broke retested i bought the market broke again and retested this level i bought again now the market start doing this consolidation here i now quickly bring out this horizontal line and mark it out mark here out then check my previous like i showed you guys and i identified that that place is a very very strong resistance zone then i exit from there then wait for selling opportunity you understand so i mark out this line this zone here i said okay now first low have been created right here so i wait for it to break and retest then after this break and retest, I bought. I sold, I mean to say. After that break and retest, I sold. Wait for another one. Break, retest, I sold. Wait for another one. If you watch my previous video, you will see this thing I'm showing you guys. Break and retest again. I sold. I sold. Then, I now see this moving average appearing below here i said okay this could be a very very strong support zone then i put my stop loss above this level then drew my trend line this way drew my trend line this way drew my trend line this way Then wait for this market to break this trend line. If we break this trend line above, like this is the first touch, this is the second touch, this is the third touch. This third touch failed to break out. It failed to break out. This is the first, this is the third, and this is the third. You can see there's not too much space there, and this is where the market broke out. You understand? Now I wait for this market to reach this level. After reaching this level, I saw this sharp move upward there with this rejection right here. So I quickly went to my daily time frame to see why that sharp move happened there. And I see that it is sitting at this level. It has retested at this level. So that gave it enough momentum for it to buy. So okay, I said okay, I went to my 30 minutes time frame, then wait for another retest understand so after seeing this retest right here after seeing this retest right here i bought from there i bought from there and to make it very very easy for you guys to, to know you can easily go to your 15 minutes time frame understand go to your 15 go to your 15 minutes time frame then you draw this trend line guys until you know the power of trend line that's where you will start making money from this trend 
for next time. So you wait there, you go there, wait for this breakout. After that, you buy. Then you go again, draw a trend line this way. Draw a trend line this way. This requires a lot of knowledge and patience, guys. If you don't have patience on this, you can't make any money here. Just be watching me how I'm doing this very, very easy. Very, very easy. There's not too much um, stress on these guys. It's even when you're using too much money average, it's when you have stress. Can't you see how my chart is very, very simple? To identify those zones understand so this is how I, I was doing it as it is breaking my trend line above I'm buying as it is breaking my trend line above I'm buying I'm buying I'm buying I'm buying you understand so this is it this is it guys this is it as it break it is breaking my trend line and buying understand so now here we go let me show you guys one thing you need to know here let's say now you bought from here you bought from here you put your stop you put your take profit here and you put your stop loss here now this market didn't hit your, uh, your TP here. It went here and reversed it. You understand? Now your stop loss is there. If you are like, if you are emotional trader, uh, you don't understand the, how the price moves, you exit from here because you are scared for the market to hit your stop loss. So after that, what happened? Poof, it went up and take your TP. You understand so that's why whenever you took a trade whenever you want to take a trade you go to your there's a four hour time frame to see the overall trend you have already identified right here that this market is going to buy for a very long time because because of only this candlestick formation only this candlestick formation right here have shown you that the sellers are getting weak like the buyers are coming you understand so that is the first thing you have to know. You understand? So now, after that, the market went down again. You see your stop, uh, TP there. The market went down again here. And like, you can't you can't buy when the market is doing this thing. This that's when traders like when traders lose their money. When you see this all this small green candle, you will think that the market is going to buy you buy then the market continue going down so you have to wait for this your trend line to break break above and retest here before you buy you understand that is that is how you can be able to manipulate this market you understand this is how you will be able to manipulate this market wait for your trend line and make sure your trend line touches like more than two, more than let us have more than two, two touch, no more than one touches. I mean, like this is the first here, this is the second, the third one, it break and retested, you buy. You understand? So this is very very simple, guys. I don't know how you guys want want me to be explaining this because I have identified, I have like, I have it have come to my knowledge that whenever I post any strategy based on scalping. You guys used to be like, used to watch it so quickly. You will see so much viewers on it. You understand? Because you guys love something that is very, very simple. I don't know if you think that this um, moving average or these indicators, they are just holy grave that you can just make money with it so quickly. No, it doesn't happen like that. It's based on price action. Even those guys, those guys that is creating robots on how to trade robots, they are not even the market makers. It's their strategy that they are using to create all those robots, in which 
in which a strategy that is good for me may not be good for you. That is certain. You have to know the price action. Then create a strategy on your own how you can be able to trade the market. That is the exact truth. That is why you are jumping from one strategy to another, one strategy to another. You have to create your own strategy for you to know what you need to know on how you can be able to trade the market. Without this, guys, you can't be making money. Like, you can make money, but all of a sudden, you can lose all of that money instantly. You understand? You can lose all of that money instantly. Because you'll be fueled with greed and impatience. You'll be forced to be entering the markets every time the moving average signify you uh, buy, sell, buy, sell. You understand? So this is very, very wrong. It's very, very wrong. Like now, um, my and I know you guys have been uh, like if you if you have been watch following my previous video on this V75, you guys might learn or one or two from this market. You understand? So okay, now let's go. I think I took a trade on a uh, crash thousand. Uh, I think crash thousand. Let's just go to daily time frame. Yeah, I took a trade here. This is it, guys. You are trading, you are catching spikes, you are trading against the spikes. All of them is based on price action. All of them is based on fucking price action. Like, why will you even be scared of catching spikes? Eh? I prefer even trading the spikes than to than to trade against the spikes i prefer catching the spikes you understand all these things they are based on candlestick formation price action now when you see this up move you will think that this market will buy forever no it's just a retracement see the overall trend is downtrend starting from here starting from here starting from this breakout right here Starting from here, if you take a cell from here, look at just look at if you eventually cut this cell from here, from here, just look at what you will be catching. You understand? So, the same thing goes here now. You see this redressment here, this upward redressment. Doesn't mean that the market have changed from uptrend to a downtrend until it break this your trend line. Until it break this your trend line. This is absolutely consolidation. This, this is what the market is doing. Consolidating to retrace to gain a lot of strength to continue the journey of selling. You understand? So right here you are not doing anything. You can do something here, but you have to wait like okay now you guys don't have patience of waiting go to your forward time frame let me just show you how you can also trend in that inside that consolidation let me just show you guys yeah now this is it this is that consolidation right here now you start from here if you want to buy like now this market is buying right here if you want to buy you see, first touch second touch third touch it broke with this okay what is the difference with the volatility 75 i showed you guys right now what is the difference hmm? what is the difference just tell me what is the difference you can see that all this market they they move the same you bought from here Put your, put your TP there or there. Aren't you, aren't you happy with this move? Aren't you happy with this move without even an indicator? Guys, I don't really know how to explain this so that you guys can know what I'm saying here. Now you see again. Now you see another opportunity again. Here. This is the break. 
this is the first touch this is the second touch and this is the third touch third touch will be broke and man manipulated this trend take out like you can buy here you can buy here now the market went against you does not mean that this market is going to sell because this trend line this the, long, the longest trend line haven't broken you understand so here it only created a head and a shoulder which uh, an inverse head and the shoulder right here which is the same thing with price action this is you can only see it in price movement this is the shoulder this is the head and this is the second shoulder you understand so you identify these zones you identify this zone you understand then you wait for this market to go inside again to give you the second shoulder when to go up again, give you this rejection, you buy from there. You buy from there, guys. This is very, very simple. Very, very simple. You understand? So, right here now, for you to know that this buying momentum is uh, fading out, you can see this consolidation. This consolidation. This is where you will be making your first move. And selling when you see this consolidation happening, you know that this the buying momentum has uh, weakened. You understand? You draw a trend line this way, you draw a trend line this way. You draw a trend line this way. You understand? Now you have waged this market right here. You have waged this market. Then you wait for a breakout and the retest. You wait for a breakout and the retest right there. Then you sell. You sell from there. Guys, this is a sniper entry. Whatever you might call it, it is a fucking sniper entry on buying on selling signal. You understand? If if before you even identify this breakout right here, you have already identified it inside your zones, guys. You can see it very clear. The price move accordingly, accordingly, guys, accordingly. So I don't know why you guys always focus on um moving average indicators, all those stuff. Guys, you have to help yourself, guys. You have to help yourself. Not tomorrow you'll be saying that um, this trading stuff is not for you. If it's not for you, it's for who? Did, it, did God create anyone in this world that say, you, you are going to be trading for us, only you alone? No. No. God gave everybody the same knowledge, the same head, the same brain. It's the way you use yours. It's the way you use yours. It's the way it's going to work for you. When you go, when you are in, in the in the school, you don't expect someone who is reading uh, reading his book, studying his book, mastering what the teacher taught him every night and day. You don't expect him to. Uh, you don't expect you that is not doing anything to know, like to have upper results more than him. It doesn't work that way. It doesn't work that way, because whatever you sow, that that is what you read. If you put a hard work on something, that's that um, a good thing you shall see. To be honest with you guys, that's how life goes, guys. This is how life goes. So this is there is no an holy grail on this uh, on this trading. You understand? So it's for you to know price action. Price action is the key is the key guys price action is the key and knowing candlestick pattern you understand if you are if you are watching video on youtube make sure you watch video on based on price action forget about indicators guys knowing too much about indicators they will make you your knowledge on price action be paralyzed they will just paralyze your knowledge and everything you know about uh, price action about how the market behaves and this is what these uh, brokers want they want you to focus on indicators so that you can be able to enter the, the trade when when it uh, at the wrong time understand 
So this is a, a, a crash, a crash thousand. So is there just tell me is there any difference with this volatility seventy five? I just show you guys. Is there any different right here? There's no different. There is no different, guys. They move the same. So I don't I don't want to make this video to be too long. If there is anything I'm missing here, like. If there is anything that is bothering you guys that you don't know how to feast, just drop the comment below. I'm gonna reply to you and add it to my next video. Understand? So, like I said, if you're new to my channel, kindly subscribe to my channel. I'll be dropping a powerful video like this one every week so that you guys can be able to master price action even though you don't um pay any mentor or anything. If you have if you have this willing of learning and understanding. You will definitely learn a lot from this channel guys so yeah this is an opera signing out